William Katla Hotinko, Kena Lengwa Hatse twenty sixty, Kidula Go Valhafal, Umuruling, or Province in your Northwest. Can I go in the Glimunia and get Hopola, Kelina Kerswanese or Reke, Ketokomele, Nike, Liseho, Ketamali and Agoscolong, Alistotu, then Ampla Isaga Mama, Alatadi. The end of the winter, the twenty six hour, the more adimazaka. Mama ona ona as a soft morona. Liana Harodis because the hopola canagoma and bota hore. The hopla canagoma to a school long. Angotla and got a la hore. Get a little later. Can again a little show me. Can you get a la hore in one no grand? Kahiki who did a little one nagi, Baba Simani. Basa would look like being in a host number to Naba beta by the spoiled. So can I get a William Mask at Honalebona in the one who could run at any mutiling in Nakabatan or at any moyo. Hike a holar nerdular le Arleban Mo 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 Montunia Yayam Coco, a le papa fella as a Mama as a sebeti. Papa na sebeta mining, so una kona kore tokomela babot. William Carter, o o le mano o o wana kore o o o bethale. Ona le aka na le future mo kilomba. I le mo tharata no keneka. O bicycle le so na itu kisita arara to kene. Intu ilenga le mo kore no mar. Mano na ona le talente. Isimulute sukolo saka go Maruta Primary School. Khona mo fal khafal. Ke ne ke le wana o utlwang. Wile mo ga go la na ke ne ke le beletse fela gore ga nne ka bona fela mo bophilong ana le boka moso bo nna ke sna mbona ka gore nna ga ka tsana school. Metric wa ka ke pasitse ka di result tse di normal. Ga ke le go metric ne ke tsana go ntse le ditsala. Mama and Nankale Mambota Horoske, I am go go to make a ball because get all get all Palagori tooth. Then Hackett Rocco Bolon, get Hattie, then get Swanna Gore, get Swanse Robala, then Kissimula Hotla Papini, then a big Roval and Segeval. Can't try as soon as you Haka Hana Pasakamoko, Nikibat. Di ho vista ga ke chese le soka le music ke simolo tsa go tsameka chese ke le middle school ka ipona gore ka bona ke ke wina gare ya di competitioning 
ke na mela stage sa ko skolong each and every time ga ga ke tswa ko ko di competition ba representa di award tsa ro ka ipona gore ne ke a kho music ke o simulotse ka ngwaga wa 2014 o ile amo a opela o stantsitse cd ya bobedi dipina sa bona ke dipina sa sekreste tsa kereke tse di dumedisang lo ena go utlile botlhoko go dutleletse go khona go thala ga ke fetsa metric wa ka ke ile ko 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 Rosebank College ke ile go dira eh information technology diploma ke tshusitse ka gore ne ke sna di maxetse di siame ke sna entry level the requirements ne ke bata go go ithuta mechanical engineering then ka tswana ko gore ke gopole ko mora go ke tswang go te gore batsa di ba ka bang sokoletse gore ke tsene skolo ya nong ke tla ithuta go fitla ke fetse so ga re simolla khoso ya rona re simolotse re le 53 mo tlase mara go graduate le bana ba le 3 ke bona gore ke rena le re tiri fela ba re graduate ke ile ka nna motlopo thata ke ipona ele gore ke dirile batsa di ba ka proud o ile ema ga graduate ke ne ke itumetse thata ka letsa dilego ke ne ke itumeletse gore le nna ngwana ke ile nna sengwe mo botshelong a tshwana le bana ba ba sa di ba ba tsa di ba bangwe bana le boka moso mo itumedisang Hagi fetsa go graduate ke ne ke sa khone go kra Merko wa Information Technology then papa a mpatlela Merko ko mmaini a mpotsa gore go na le dipost to ke apply e be ka apply ka kra Merko o as a plant attendant ya re gantsa sebetse ka mara ka re tswela pele o wetse di ene tsa engineering once o na le di ene tse o and two and three tsa engineering then o tlo thola e di lena shipi mo na tse di lo di company ga njinji di ntse di lena shipi di nwa khona ka ra lena shipi wa train up em sebetse mo ka re skolo ga khona gore wa sa fela e se tswela pele le ga ntse le mokhala bo tsena skolo mm ha ke sebetsa ko mine ke utlwetse ka sandik apprenticeship ya di melright and ka playa ha ke fetsa ho playa ka ba successful apprenticeship e na ya melright ene e se related to information technology ka gore yona ke ke fita and electrician combined ke apply ile ka gore ko ntleng ke ne ke batlo ithutela mechanical engineering ka bona gore le yona e ka khona gore in leader le ko mechanical engineering ke feditse training ya ka le Sandvik Academy ka moso ke ke a tsama ke a interview ya specialist trainee for technical department ke kopa modimo gore a mo fe matla a a a iketse a a phelantsa smaela then skia ba mo theka re ke mo thwa kwa tile then na itumele mo then modimo ke na le sepa gore o tla metela pele go mo form service hanga tola mo sebetsi o ke a gore ka ntlo ka gore yona ke long term investment
Guys, keep it chill. Most of the key, get there for my interview. We are specialist trainee. Get to real. Kafa get to meet to worry. Get to create some safety. And get to see what I'm capable of. And then get to see what I'm capable of. And get to get to pass the interview. Good morning, Katlejo. Um, thank you for taking the time to attend the interview for the trainee specialist position at Sandvik. Uh, my name is Vic Tambata, I'm the HR manager at Sandvik and uh, my colleague here is Vusi Mguni. Um, I will ask Vusi to take you through the, the process in terms of um, today's proceedings. How are you? I'm good and you sir. Good, good. What is what's going to happen today, we're going to take you through a couple of practical assessments in our workshops uh, that are relating to what you have learned uh, at the college. How was it for you? Your highlights? What did you like? Okay. Uh, the career path for me was, was awesome. I really enjoyed it because at first, my, my career path was mechanical engineering. Then I never had a chance to go to, to university to go and study it. So when I got the opportunity, I grabbed it with two hands and made sure that everything goes well and I enjoy every moment of it. I'm sure you already privy to this information, but I'm just gonna give you an overview of Sandvik and who Sandvik is. Sandvik is an engineering company uh, started in 1862 in Sandviken, Sweden. There are obviously many business areas within uh, Sandvik, but in South Africa, our largest portion of market is money. We do with load and haul, drilling machines, construction machines. We also do a lot of uh, material handling machines. And I am sure that throughout your training, you might have come across some of these machines in many mines in South Africa and Southern Africa. Katlero, uh, what does your, your trade entail? And I'm asking this question because I, I, I need to know from you, how does it then fit in with Sandvik's core business? My trade entail uh fitting mechanical and electrical. Then in Sandvik, when the breakdowns, when there's a breakdown and they send me, I will attend either electrical breakdown or mechanical uh, breakdown. And what do you guys call it? Can you rephrase the, it? Yeah, the name of the trade? Oh, millwright. Okay. If we... We're now sitting with a decision where we have to choose a trainee specialist, which is a position that you applied for. Why should we consider you? Okay. Firstly, I'm, I'm good in communicating with other employees, always punctual at work. And also, if you can have a look at my previous record, I don't like being absent. I also, the person who doesn't drink as young people drink and they don't come back to work on Monday. Also, I have the computer skills for use in the company. Now, as an apprentice now, what were some of your greatest achievements there? On my apprenticeship program, I was one of those guys who were good performers. And I managed to get the awards, apprentice of the year, and also most disciplined. 
including the merits performance, outstanding performance in all that I was doing. I was putting all my efforts. Okay, Katleho, what's going to happen from here? Um, um, I will hand you over to Tabiso, who is going to take you through some work-related practical tasks. Um, and we will receive feedback from him, um, after which we will then be in contact with you and inform you whether you've been successful for this role or not. Okay, sir. Okay. Good luck with the practical assessments. Uh, I'm sure you know Tabi, so he's been your mentor. So give it your best and hope to see you once you're done. Okay. Thank, you. Thank you very much. Company. Hi Lady Mel Raisi, di kwa tisite makaleng afa paning adi atizini. Hava kreta baita apprentice shipi, basebeti lidi atizini ka ufapana. Kamra wa hadi shoka ka ufela, bafuma na mwenyeta ole kanetzing. Hori ekaba di technicieni, di engineera, di foremeni, di plena. Lita di nse batlambu khoni ba mechanicali, kapa electricali. Mahasla, to ole ka ufela tena, kika ponelo peli ya sewe na obatla unko basona. Eta usupa ntila, e otla mea uwinka, Horu ufiche mo ota me anku ficha ten. Wena fela unka kaeto o kalela haoleeto. Hasla joba sla zi inti zio zama hasla zba fetu zikai i bo zile apa na giti ba ya pigi shala apa na ba ya kono nda basa bensa ge social media bafetu agu trend la apa na basa bensa mashtek afana no fees must fall na bota tama must fall ugleta ushin chenoku zoga sage amapimbo abo noku vesa ge inti inga ba pegane nazo nifunu wa singa be social media bafetu izo snaite no mage lo tinga uti snaite jenga encha bafetu tate inya chelo e bands ugleta ushin cho giti ni nashe gile apa na ge agu basa bensa nuga i hashtag bafetu ug paul la kona la apa na ku social media bafetu kwa zba uti nati na kala i hashtag encha ibizo uti hashtag Spani for hustlers. My name is Tabiso Mtembu. I've been with Senvik for over 10 years now. I'm responsible for all the apprentices that are, are working here at Senvik. William. I see, yeah, the overall fits you well, eh? That's nice, that's nice. Um, I'm going to give you three tasks today, but uh, the first one, it's going to be your brake uh, system. Uh, you're going to check my brake wear limit. Then, uh, before you do that, uh, we will need you to do a risk assessment to ensure that all the safety parts of this machine, you understand them and you are clear. In task one, uh, William was required to check the brake wear limits of uh, that machine. We needed to raise the bucket, support the bucket, ensure that it is safe for anyone who works under the machine. For the task that you're about to do, you are going to use this instrument. Uh, this is a measuring tool. I'm sure you are very aware of it. You've used it so many times. So there it is. And uh, then we can go to the machine. Okay. All right. Sikumulema <laughs> William, as I mentioned to you earlier, that before you do any job in this workshop, you have to complete a risk assessment. So this is the risk assessment. So please complete it for me. And uh, let's carry on. Okay. Uh, firstly, I'm gonna have a look at my bucket, if it's completely on the floor. 
and I can see it's completely on the floor for in case of uncontrolled movement. A male right uh, is a person who undergoes uh, the apprenticeship program. Uh, this individual will have two trades, an electrical trade and a fitting trade. And then my isolator, it's also in an off position. My apprenticeship took three years while I was doing nine months here on the, on the workshop, doing the practical work. Then I had to be sent six months to the technical uh, training center, whereby I was doing my trade test there. Everything is perfect. Also this side, no obstructions. Then here, I'm going to check my oil levels for my hydraulic tank. The most challenging part of apprenticeship was when I had to learn from my artisans the hard way and had to make sure that I know everything and the standard that has to be met. I'm satisfied with the, the way you did your risk assessment. I can just move you directly to the task. Okay, sir. No right. problem. Let's go to the task. Before we do the task, I need you to be safe. So for you to be safe, we are going to raise the bucket and the boom, support it, so that you can have all the access that you need for that wheel over there. Actually, for, the, for both the wheels, okay? All right, let's go. Uh, can you move the bucket? We have to maintain this machine each and every day, especially when the machine is at site. The kind of person that would be suitable for millwright would be an individual that is uh, very disciplined, punctual, and keen to learn, and also loves mechanical way. All right, William, this is where you are going to be doing your brake system. Go and okay. check it for me there. And then when you're done, you just uh, show me the figure, the wear limit, and then we'll take it from there. Okay, no problem. All right. We have different types of maintenance that we can do on the machine, which is a pre preventive maintenance and a plant maintenance. Yes, and plant maintenance is like service, when you're taking your car to service. Obviously, you have to plan it and everything, but preventive, preventive maintenance is when I see that maybe one component it will be damaged, then I change it immediately. It doesn't bother me to work underneath because it's part of my job. That's why they provide us with protective clothing and everything. What are you actually doing there? What are you checking there? Uh, I'm gonna check my wear limit. That's why I'm making sure that it's, it's pressed. And yeah. remember this type of our braking system, when the machine is not running, the bricks apply. So when there is no hydraulic oil or pressure, the bricks will apply via the spring. Two point five. So what does this mean? It means this side our bricks are still in good condition. Thank you very much. Okay. There you are. I think the first task of brick wells. I, I did, I did do it perfectly, yes. 
As soon as uh, uh, William was done with the brake test, we were able to tell whether the brakes were still serviceable uh, or not. And in our case, they were fine. components My hustler, Mosebeti, Kisi Ponisamoto Yense, Luena Yetamusebetu, how hunt like Abu Habani, Lady Keto Sahaut Abu Pilo, Dita La Tela. How about our Kenalika Lena, or talk a great nine Nika Pacaho Dimo, Hopola or Messi a compulsory. Said inside the subject, take out two sang, give trade theory, electrically, Gapa technical drawing, Ntona Ehabedi, Giddy practically, and a happy theory. Theory a how, Okai Fumanako FET College. The practical o tla mea ho thola mosebetsi ene tseo o tla dietsa ka tlase ha taelo ya mohiri wa hao ha so qetile dintho tseo ka o fela o tla etsa teko ya hao mane ko department of labor gore o qualify go ba artisane ha sa re khutlela go yena katleho re bona a suta ho dintho tsa mechanical a ya go tsa di electronics thanks uh, for completing the first task we are going to do your second task, which is calibration, where you are going to calibrate my joysticks, your boom and your bucket, your acceleration, and also your steering. Okay. Are you comfortable with that? I'm comfortable, sir. Yes, so we can move along to the cabin. In task two, William uh, was required to check the joystick calibrations to ensure that the movements of the buckets and the booms and even the steering and the acceleration are all perfect for usage in the mine. When we do calibrations, we make sure that uh, our mechanical valves and mechanical part actually, they respond to the electrical part because our machine is a combination of mechanical and is connected through electrical and the computers. So when you move your joystick electrically, it must control the mechanical valves. I'm gonna go to the left and I get 0 0.49 volts. What, you, what was that on your left? 0 0.49 volts. Okay. University is, is very, very, very important. Varsity and, uh, and training, uh, both of them, when you uh, bring them together, they bring out this, uh, this beautiful thing. I mean, uh, companies are run by people like that. And we're gonna go to the steering. We did calibration to make sure that our steering can go fully on the left and fully on the right. I will calibrate the the pedal now, acceleration pedal, because we lose we're using the electronic acceleration pedal. Okay. Normal position, I'm getting 0.49. Then now I'm gonna press it down there in full throttle. I'm getting 4.32 volts. When I first uh, worked on these machines, the control system, it was very difficult to understand. And I saw many buttons and screens and everything I didn't even understand. But on my apprenticeship program, I made sure I know everything about it so that when I'm qualified, I will know what to do and where to go. William, uh, you've just completed your steering uh, calibration, uh, accelerator calibration, your boom and bucket uh, 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 calibration. We just need to know how are you going to uh, check if the settings were done correctly and they are within the, the limits of the machine. Okay, I'm just gonna, we're just gonna start the machine and check if the settings are correct. All right.
Once you are a millwright, nobody stops you from becoming an engineer. It is a route. You can become an engineer after that. So the opportunities are, are good for a candidate like that. The nice thing about this career as well is that you are able to see what you have started. You can build a machine from scratch all the way until you complete the machine. That's how beautiful it is. And you know very well when you're sitting at home with your family, uh, somebody out there has a job because you have built a machine that somebody must go and operate and feed their family. When I was moving my baguette, the reason why my baguette wasn't moving smoothly, it is because I didn't balance it with the accelerator. I can get my movement smoothly by practice. We did calibration to make sure that our bucket can go fully up and fully down. Bring back the boom. The braking system on the LHD, we use springs to apply the brakes. And when we put the pressure to that spring, we depress that spring, then the brakes releases. When compared to a car whereby you need to press it manually, then the brakes apply. Just two, it was also uh, uh, challenging a bit for him, uh, but he managed to pull through, except that uh, uh, when, it, when it came to the testing of the boom, it was a little bit erratic, but I can understand. It's an assessment and, you know, a bit of fear, it's always there. And it's something that we can always fix uh, over a day. It's not something that it will take three years to sort it out. Manufacturing. Um, thanks for the task that you've done. I can imagine you are very tired now, but uh, this is the last one. Um, we are going to do the camera. You are going to fit the camera for us. You are also going to do adjustments to the camera to ensure that uh, when the person who's operating that machine is able to see all the blind spots. Okay. Are you comfortable with that? Yeah, I'm comfortable. All right, I'm happy. Task three, it's one of the most critical tasks. You need to understand that this machine works underground and visibility sometimes is not always uh, great. So when we fit cameras like that, I was looking for how well can William adjust the camera so that he covers the blind spots. Living the easy buffet, eating is support. Uspani nine to five every week. Ufagi effort. Jenga select buffet. U William Ianzile. Tumaga akutu la matask. Ngata aga waboni. Instead of in a corner, pile footi ebe na kuzi na fuku fuku. Efuga mtule noi. Pile footi ofuga la pana kumatask wa yo. Giti na la pana kanya jambo la buffet. No kuzi na fuku fuku la pana kuwa jambo. So I think you nothing. You guys another two, which is the letter U buffet. Giti muzo kuna kumneta. Kuna man. Is touch careful as I say, it is not over till the fat lady sings, or should I say, until William Buffett, I got it that task. Get to call a magician, one of us move, you're a fetch, 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 you're a f
William. Um, this is the monitor that you'll be uh, using to view your camera, your camera position. Okay. And this is the camera you'll be using. And uh, this is the one that you're going to connect for me. Okay. All right, William, carry on with your camera. On that rig, I installed a camera because it helps the operator to see his blind side. And it will be safer for, for, for him not to bump anything or not to bump any person. Camera there. University and uh, skills uh, uh, development training they complement each other uh, because what usually happens with varsities is that you only get the theory part of things and you get this little bit of exposure in the industry whilst in the skills development uh, training you are more exposed to the hands-on uh, skills. And now I'm gonna power my camera. And yes, I'm gonna, it's for the signal and power for the camera. Yes. The machine that we, we were busy installing the camera on is a long hole drilling machine. Is the one that the mines are using to make sure to, to cohere the, the levels. Like level, if there's a level at the top and a level underneath, then they will drill up to, it can drill up to 38 meters. Now that you have uh, fitted the camera, how do you know that the camera is uh, properly fitted and all that? We'll have to use the monitor and see if the camera is in a good range. All right, yes. can we proceed to there? Okay, no problem. Now on the, on the screen I can see the front camera is operating. Then my reverse one is also working, but it's not in a good range. Then we'll have to set it up. Yes. When you setting up the camera, you cannot do it alone. You have to have somebody who will tell you that uh, the camera is in a good position and tell you that you have to take it a little bit up or down. In the long term, I want to be a contract manager because I like working with people. I'm open to everybody and what you see is what you get. And I like to share my knowledge with other people. Katleho, uh, welcome back. Um, how did you find your technical assessment? My technical assessments were very easy and quite challenging at the same time. I'm very happy with my performance. Okay. Look, uh, William, we have had an opportunity to meet with Tabisa and obviously he's given us uh, feedback on your performance. When you did your breaks did very well all the tasks here show that you're actually competent in performing there is 
an area of improvement where we feel that you can actually improve. It's not something that's going to take you a long time to work on, but the jerky movement of the bucket, that's an area that you might want to look at in future and just make sure that the operation is very, very smooth for you because you don't want the machine jumping up the down. Okay? On the camera, the installation and the making sure that your camera actually focuses on all the areas, especially the blind spots. You know, these machines are big. So you need to have a better view of where you're going, who might be behind the machine. You also did that very well. Before I actually tell you what our decision is, I'm gonna paint you a picture and say to you, Sunweek operates in more than 130 countries in the world. If you get this position, you might be deployed in any of those countries. It is an opportunity that comes to a very few individuals and once in a lifetime opportunity. The mining, which is uh, Sandvik Mining Rocket uh, Technology, only accounts for about 10% of what Sandvik is all about. So there is a world of opportunity for you within the organization. And obviously we invest in our human resources like we have done with you. In as far as your assessment and interview is concerned, you've got a job. Yes. Yes. You've yes. got a job. Uh, we're quite happy to have you on the team. We think you're going to be an asset to us and we would like to keep you. Okay, somebody from the HR department will be in touch with you uh, to discuss the offer and um, the way going forward in as far as your appointment is concerned. Okay, sir. Okay, you thank you. Hey guys, I got the specialist trainee job. Now it's going to change my life. I'm gonna be able to buy myself a house that I've been dreaming of and I can be able to do everything that I want to do for myself. Also, to all the hustlers there, presser, pusher, panda. Well done, Katleho. Riboni ka wena gore mosebetsi o motle o hlalosa tsela e wa etsamaileng go tloga mo o qadileng teng. Ho ho ngata ho tlameng go ithuta hona empa wena o ikemiseditse. Botso ya rona ya beke ena e tswa go sibusiso. A rena ona le gatlho ya o ithutela filimi and TV production. After ena le di options tse tso letseng ena hape bana le di campus mona na heng. Haya certificate ya bona ke tulo entle ya go qala. O ka eketsa wa yetsa degree ha e ka ba wa batla. Tshakela website ya bona ene hape bana le di scholarship le di bazaar. E ngwetsela o ka engang ke city varsity. Bana le di certificate le di diploma options. Ho ya ka o fapana ha dikolo empa o tlhoka metric gore o tsebe o qala. Ma hasla se ho polang gore di internship di bazaar le di leadership di tholahala pele October a ka fela. Hi, I'm going to go to the house. I'm check on Facebook and the website. I'm going to get to the house. And the award for the best male ride goes to... William! I'm going to go to the house. 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 I'm going to go to it's a um, cool work gospel, but fetch. You're pinning foot here, recorder. I'm a album, I'm a bean. You don't have a camera that's full of a pungo chamber of fetch. You albums, um, we told you, we call standard, but fetch. Um, we're going we see the illness crash, go to my pillow, but fetch is a bit better anywhere chamber, who vigi el zio. Mina of an ampo, Tosa Zonkin Tampo, and Sotana La Panaga, and Kuzins of Kuman of a fetch, Twitter and Facebook, and YouTube. And remember, it's not a website, but fetch. Open the football and repeat it to go Thursday, go 11 o'clock. You're selling challenges. Don't look down, look up and stay up. Si vala ngi kospel ngi si hai du maya samaya kolo kolo iya eli shaba fesun boy.